When we got independence in 1947, we were the largest, most sophisticated economy in Asia, and we were the economy which had 1.5 billion pounds owned by Great Britain for the war, a very good army and a very good functioning industrial sector. Then, after 1950 and just before that, Nehru brought in disastrous economic policies, taking us on the path what he called socialism. He didn't understand economics, I think, and he made India poorer, and he suppressed Indian capital. Nobody is against the public sector, but he suppressed Indian capital, brought in license quota raj, and centralized economic decision making in Delhi, and made it very, very uh, corrupt and subject to capture by people who capture the government and got what they want and get monopoly profits. As a result, India grew at 3.5 percent a year from 1950 to 1980. Population grew at 2.5 percent a year. Per capita income grew at only 1 percent a year for 30 years. 